Dragons, are they out there? Were they ever? What about the mysterious post about baby dragons for sale or the video of a dragon flying back and forth in the sky on a cloudy day? Let's take a look at viral dragon images and videos and explain what we are really seeing. Real beast or an extraordinary hoax? Find out here. Eight Dragon Sightings Explained What was the 80s movie that featured a white dragon whose famous line was, Never give up and good luck will find you? And what was the dragon's name? Find out at the end of the video. Number 8. Dragons for Sale Six baby dragons for sale on a Facebook post stated and continued to say that they are ready for new homes and you don't need a permit to have one. People who viewed the post jumped at the chance to have their very own little dragon. Tons of direct messages, comments, and calls flooded in to Ben O'Stanner who originally posted the Facebook post. People even offered to send money ahead of time so that they were insured to be the first in line to receive a dragon. People wanted to know how big they were, could they see them in person, and anything else that got them closer to owning one. They are pretty cute, and maybe people just want to believe. Can you blame them for that? Needing something magical and ancient to believe in. Stander says he didn't take advantage of people's willingness to believe and didn't take money from them, even though they were practically throwing it at him. He said the whole thing's amusing and quite alarming. 7. Romanian Ice Dragon Dragon lovers and conspiracy theorists all around the vast web are still going bananas over this mummified dragon corpse. Although some pages popped up claiming it was found in China, most of them stick to the original story of the remains being discovered frozen solid in a block of ice in a remote cave in the Carpathian Mountains in Romania. The only problem with the original story is that it is totally fiction. The only place where this dragon mummy ever existed was a filmmaking studio. Back in 2004, Discovery Channel aired a masterfully done piece called The Last Dragon, alternatively known as Dragons of Fantasy Made Real. The prop we see in this picture, which was later on named the Ice Dragon by overzealous internet dwellers, is the very first beast we see in the movie surrounded by likewise mummified corpses of 15th century knights. The flick is a little less than two hours of a fantasy world slash sci-fi getaway set in our own natural world and rooted in actual science and anatomy. However, unfortunately, every single dragon in there is just CGI or a prop. Viewer comment time. We'd like to give a big thanks to our subscribers who leave us comments, especially when you make a video suggestion. Let's give a shout out to Kitty Kato Nightfiery, who posted on our video about trees that have faces. Number 6. Fell from the Sky in August 2016, there was a video posted online which supposedly depicted a real dragon found dead on a beach. The video earned over 1.5 million views within just three days after it was initially uploaded, and the story was that the dragon fell from the sky in Tibet. However, even though many enthusiasts were thrilled by the story, it was quickly proven to be entirely false. The corpse of the mythical creature was just a dragon statue, which was made for a Spanish TV show called Puerto Milenio. This show deals with cryptozoology, conspiracy theories, mythical creatures, and that sort of thing. The dragon statue was created for an episode which featured a fake documentary, like the ones people made about mermaids or the supposedly revived Megalodon. In fact, in another video which shows the whole process of how the dragon statue was created can be found on YouTube. Sorry to send your dreams of this dragon flying through the air crashing down. 
five, a surprisingly clear camera shot of a dragon flying over a Chinese mountain range. Back in 2016, a video on YouTube got dragon fans everywhere in a fever. It was recorded in China, apparently somewhere near the border with Laos, and shows a dragon, or something like a dragon, flying over a mountain range. The many theories shot at the video range from actual living, breathing, well, fire-breathing dragons through alien creatures called draconians, through the idea of a pterodactyl that somehow survived the dinosaur apocalypse. By the way, they have been undoubtedly extinct for about 66 million years to just a huge bird. However, the overall consensus seems to be that the video is a scam. People pointed out that the dragon is way too similar to CGI and that its silhouette is just too sharp compared to the blurry surroundings which are little more than a jumble of pixels. They also pointed out that a cell phone camera wouldn't be able to focus on a single object in its frame like that and that it is suspicious that the supposed dragon just disappears when it reaches the Rocky Mountains. Do you believe in dragons? Let us know in the poll section in the upper right-hand corner. If you think you've seen a dragon, tell us about it in the comment section below. Number 4. White Dragon In March 2015, the internet went crazy about yet another Chinese dragon story. The case was reported from West Malaysia, where a Chinese fruit farmer supposedly shot and killed a real Chinese dragon in his home. For those of you who don't know, Chinese dragons look pretty much like snakes with antlers with four legs that have sharp claws and often a pair of appendages on their snouts that look a lot like those things you find dangling off a catfish. The creature killed by this farmer looked exactly like that and was supposedly eating his rabbits. However, back in 2014, the exact same picture was posted claiming that the dragon was caught by a Mongolian fisherman. Well, dragons are supposed to be these fantastic mythical creatures with great wisdom and fearsome, awe-inspiring magical powers. So maybe this guy decided to come back to life and try revisiting humans. Yeah, nope. On June 24th, 2014, some genius posted a video online trying to prove that the dragon was indeed real and dead, but they forgot to remove the images which showed the dragon to be just a sculpture created specifically for this purpose in an art studio. Number 3. The World Eater Let's move a little closer to the western side of the globe, away from snakes with mustaches and more into the realm of gigantic flying lizards soaring through the local skies. England has its fair share of crazy mythology and freakishly odd folk tales, and of course, they feature all kinds of dragon lore as well. Probably the two most famous dragon stories from England are the ones about the Red Welsh Dragon and the White English Dragon battling it out every night beneath King Vortigern's proposed castle-building site. And then, that 2013 video of a dragon flying over Truro. The video shows a pretty spiky, incredibly clumsy dragon which goes around swinging its wings totally backwards while the local pigeons sit on a wire and watch with zero interest. The pigeon's unusual calm already makes this clip suspicious, not to mention that the dragon looks just a little bit too much like it popped right out of Skyrim after one too many horns of ale. But the scammers sold themselves out when they wrote in the video description, Credit Audio Color World. As it turned out in the end, that particular YouTube channel loves posting CGI videos like random UFOs too close for comfort or a guy supposedly teleporting around a forest. To make it worse, the 3D model tool for creating a dragon just like that one is easily available online. Oops. Number 2. 160 feet long just near the end of last year, so in the third week of October 2017 to be precise, there was another dragon story from China. These guys really like to make an internet sensation out of their mythological heritage, it would seem. 
supposedly the video this time was taken in Zhang Jai Kao, and that is not even some tiny village in the backwater wastelands, but a major city in northern China in the northwestern Hebei province. It has a population of 4.3 million and is one of the host cities for the 2022 Olympics, so you would not expect a place like that to come up with a video like this. The story was published at a website called Wukong at wukong.com. And according to a translation of the original Chinese text, it claimed that the dragon's skeleton was measured at 60 feet long. It was long and serpentine, just like the dragons of Chinese myth had a skull with horns and two little legs at the joint where the neck and body came together. No squiggly mustache this time around. However, several witnesses described the skull as looking more like that of an antelope and the bones like a bunch of cow remains thrown together. Add in the fact that it is lying on top of a mostly undisturbed area of grass, not buried in layers of earth and rock like most fossils, and that it is arranged so tidily, whereas the bones of a freshly dead dragon would be scattered around or even carried away by vultures. And this discovery is boiling down to most likely just another web hoax by bored attention seekers. Number 1. Gutted This is a picture that popped onto the World Wide Web some time ago from, where else, China, and has kept being posted and reposted on Reddit, cryptozoology sites, entertainment pages, and anywhere else it can get sensationalized without anyone ever saying where the original picture came from. So the story goes like this. A man in China somehow got hold of a real dragon. Maybe he went dragon hunting, robbed the gods, broke into a mythical pet store for the Chinese school of witchcraft and wizardry. Whichever the case, the man got hold of a dragon and decided to gut it, probably for an epic dish of spicy dragon stew, while his dog is playing around with the strange creature's tail. Since nobody really knows who the man is or where this picture was taken, opinions are divided regarding what is actually happening here. Most people agree that it is a hoax, with the most popular explanations being a dragon toy, a partial Photoshop of some kind of rubbery prop, or an actual dead snake painted over and augmented with decorations, either physical or digital, to give it a dragon-like look. Since the thing is limp, the legs are stiff and the dog is apparently playing with something, a dead, overly decorated snake seems to be the most likely explanation. The never-ending story, an epic fantasy movie based on the book with the same name by Michael End. The luck dragon's name was... Falkor. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to press that subscribe button. Coming up next, 10 interesting dinosaur facts you didn't know were true. Dinosaurs appeared off of the face of the planet 65 million years ago. Although over the past few years, there have been many efforts to debunk this popular Hollywood myth. A lot of people still have a problem wrapping their heads around it, especially when photos like this pop up. How is that not a plesiosaurus of some sort? Look at its four flippers, broad but...